types of transport need fuel, and the main fuel used at present is fossil fuel. Fossil fuels are fuels formed by the antirobic decomposition of dead buried organisms that died millions of years ago. As such, they are non-renewable, since reserves are being depleted and no new resources are being made. Burning fossil fuels also release the high percentages of carbon stored in them. It is this that increases the rate of global warming, leading to climate change. Natural gas is methane-based fossil fuel, mostly found in coal beds. It is extremely expensive to produce due to the need to remove all the impurities. Hydrogen is a non-fossil fuel gas. It chemically combines with the oxygen to produce electricity to power the vehicle and water vapour. Ethanol and straight vegetable oil are both plant-based fuels. Ethanol is made up from the fermentation of corn stalks or sugarcane, but is about a third less efficient than petrol. Vegetable oil, like that left over from fast food restaurants, needs special fuel tanks to reduce its viscosity and make it flow better. This leaves petroleum, often known as crude oil, as the number one fuel source to power the industrial nations. It is found in large underground reservoirs and needs to be refined before it is used. The lighter petroleum fuels generally have a lower boiling point and less carbon atoms in each molecule whereas the heavier fuels have a much higher boiling point and many more carbon atoms. The lightest forms of petroleum are both gas, liquefied petroleum gas and propane and butane and contain just three or four carbon atoms. Petrol is the next lightest fuel with seven carbon atoms followed by jet fuel and kerosene used for loading and heat heating. Diesel is a heavier fuel used for cars, lorries and trains with nine carbon atoms. Light and heavy fuel oil is used for large engines with heavy fuel oil being used for large ships have more than 10 carbon atoms. Our world uses about 88 million barrels of crude oil each day. That's over 14 billion litres and none of it is being renewed. As fossil fuel sources run out or become less acceptable, scientists have had to find more reliable and renewable fuel sources. Back to the studio.